Hey one, welcome back to Spider-Man. I put the map on the waypoint, but it's got the little check mark by it, so I don't think we really need to go there then. Uh, no, we don't need to do that. Yeah, we still like again. I keep saying we go back to the lab later, and I think that's just what we need to do, uh, especially when there's like a green check mark there. So I think because next day we'll get a lot more um, things we can do at the lab. Oh, that was a Batman poster. Wouldn't that be crazy? I mean, not like Batman specifically, but kind of like a spoof knockoff. But that was not the case. Folks, I have to once again defend myself against the spurious claims from McDonald Mac Gargan, a.k.a. The Scorpion. Yes, as I fully disclosed, I bankrolled the experiment that gave him superior strength, speed, and that unsightly cyborg tail. The idea was to create an anti-Spider-Man who is not a threat and stops menaces. I had no idea he was crazy. Do you think his resume said psycho with a poisoning fetish? His lawsuit is a transparent attempt to reduce his sentence at the raft by placing the blame for his deeds on me. And that is one package J. Jonah Jameson refuses. Uh, so, yeah, in the comics, J.J. was responsible for having a hand in Scorpion's creation because, like he said, he wanted that experiment thing. Uh... In this situation, like, yeah, I would say Matt Gargan is um, responsible for his crimes. But also, it's kind of like, I feel like JJ was so hungry to get rid of Spider Man that he didn't really consider the candidate too well. So, but, you know, I'm going to sign for the blame in this instant. Almost morning. Mr. Lee will be here soon. I could use a snack. Oh boy. This is going to get. Spicy drama time. Cream cheese bagel. And coffee. Dude, Spider-Man, do you ever sleep? Mr. Lee's usually in his office now. Is it morning? Did I just pull an all-nighter? Dude, Spider Man, you need to get some sleep every now and then, man. How's the guys holding up all right? This moron thinks I'm going to move in with my daughter. Hey, that'd be great. She hasn't asked, and she's not gonna. I'm not going anywhere. You don't know that. Nobody does. Well, I'm not going anywhere. That's a promise. Good old Spider Man just being a good person. Peter. How are you? That's good that people have the knee like this. I have a lot of respect for people who um, aid in humanitarian efforts like this. Where is his office? I feel like... I won't be able to find it. Partnership with restaurants and grocery stores works great. Any surplus food comes right here. That's great. Just good things. Um, directors is probably up the stairs. Yeah, look at that. It is morning. There's probably things I can do at the lab. You can tell like that's where my head's at. It's like I just want to. I just want to go to the lab, man. Director, that is him. Let's go. Good day, sir. Peter. What can I do for you? I'm sorry to bother you, Mr. Lee. I have a friend, Mary Jane. She's a reporter. She's doing a story on art imports, and she found this piece. Well, she wanted an expert opinion on it, and I know you have a degree. And this might be the first time I actually get to use it. Let's see what you have. Interesting. Oh, boy. Where'd she find it? I hope this guy's not evil. I'm really not sure. Boy, what is it? replica of an antique Chinese opera mask. I haven't seen one in years. This symbol here roughly translates to demon. Demon? 
Well, that's pleasant. Uh, my father read me ghost stories with that mask and symbol in it when I was young. Scared the hell out of me. Peter, listen. That mask, it's... It could be connected to dangerous people. Oh, he knows. Mary Jane might want to find a different story. Do you think she's in trouble? Uh, I don't know. Why take the risk? 100%. Dude, oh my goodness, he's the villain. Dang it, Martin, I want to trust you, man. I'm calling out. He is doing you rings. Oh my goodness, he's the new villain. Hey. The symbol inside the mask means demon. It really spooked Mr. Lee. Never seen him like that. He even said you should drop the story. Fat chance. Do you think Mr. Lee knows more than he's letting on? No, I think he just had a weird flashback or something. I know his childhood was pretty traumatic. Yeah, that makes sense. Demons, huh? Catchy name. Okay, gotta get writing. See you soon. Well, that went about as well I as I could have hoped. I... I don't know, man. Dude, Mr. Lee, he knows way more than he's letting on. 100%. I'm calling it now. This is like the plot twist of Fallout 4, which I was about just to, like, blurt it out, but I realized how people watching this may not have played Fallout 4 yet, so I won't say anything. What about my dog? No problem. But oh, my dog, no problem. And never in the kitchen area. That's awesome. Dude, dogs are important, man. I, I love dogs. Dogs are my everything. That Well, that's not true, but I do really like dogs. Oh, my goodness, I miss having dogs. Dogs were... Oh, now I'm sad. <laughs> this is just like... like This playthrough, really, all it is is just me... Um, wearing my emotions, like, on an open sleeve. Uh, because I'm too busy enjoying the experience. Like, this is... Um, a free train of thought, really. Got some time Ask. to kill before Doc needs me at the lab. Let's do a little Spidey work out in the city. As far as I say, upgrade your gears and ability. All right. Uh, I mean, I need to go to the apartment. Thug crimes are done here. That's done. That's done. Um, honestly, I guess we could do... Oh, and the side missions are done, too. How about that? I think we can probably explore more districts, if we're being honest. And I guess we'll start with this one. Oh, new side mission unlocked. Oh, where's this? Uh, I will probably do the side mission, then. If I can. Uh, side mission, where are you? Oh, here it is. Spider-Man. Alright, well. Away we go, then. It's three kilometers away. I guess we'll just, just head over there, then. See, like, I was so expecting Spider-Man to go back to his apartment to, like, rest up. But he's like, no, I'll just pull an all-nighter, which is absolutely crazy to me. I never paid rent either. Peter, Mr. Lee spoke to me. He seemed worried. Are you into something dangerous? Oh, it's just a story Mary Jane's investigating. Don't worry. I'll make sure she's careful. Please tell me you two are back together. We're talking again. Baby steps. I hope I didn't upset Mr. Lee. He's just concerned. I was actually touched by how concerned. I knew he liked you. He admires how dedicated you are to helping others. I think you remind him of himself when he was younger. Both orphans, both so smart. Well, the admiration's mutual. You've got a good boss, May. I'll tell him you said so. Love you, Peter. Dude, I, I don't know, man. Mr. Lee, he's, he's gotta have some. There's no way he's like, oh, I have a clear record. A hundred... Is that the Avengers Hello? Tower? Peter, it's Dr. Octavius. Oh, hey, what's up? 
Lance Corporal Texador is here for a fitting. I totally forgot. I mean, I mean, I, I didn't forget, forget, I just... I, I'll be there soon. <sighs> this tardiness is starting to become a pattern. Come on, Parker. You're better than this. <sighs> He's right. How did I lose track of time? <sighs> Oh dear. Well, first of all, first things first. This I can't see how this is not. Officers needed in the vicinity of Vanderbilt. Oh boy, there's a lot to do. And I think we're gonna go to the lab for a fitting after I take this photo. This photo is gonna be the most on oh, Oscorp too. Oh boy. Yep. I mean, like, this was like a freebie. Would you look at that? Half the crime tower's back up already. When spider cops on the job, come hell or high water, the job gets... Nope, nope, nope. Nope. She'd never admit it, but the chief was warming up to spider cop. His casual disregard for by-the-book thinking was a breath of fresh air. She'd come around. Someday. Okay, well, with that in mind, I'm going to end the episode. So, guys, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.